so in this video we are going to do java jdk setup that means java development kit and here we will try to follow three steps first of all we'll try to download java jdk then we'll install and after that we'll try to set the java home path so you can open any web browser and just search java jdk download and here you can see the latest version of java currently jdk 22 in the market and here you can see all the system so i'm going to download for the windows and here i'm going to select installer and you can try to download so you can see here download has been done now double click you'll get a pop-up just select yes again select next and just click on close now if you open cmd and just type java space version you can see here we have successfully installed and it is showing here java version 22 so when you will try to download maybe you will get 23 or 24 or any latest version you can also downgrade like java 7 or 8 or 11 everything is fine so now we'll try to set the java path in the environment variable because sometime you try to compile and run your code on that time we might get like java is not available so what you can do just search environment variable and open that one and you can see environment variable option and here we need to set the user variable and system variable so what you can do just click on new and type here java underscore home and here you can browse like where that java has been installed so you can open this pc c drive program files and if you scroll down here you can see the java folder so here you can see java 21 and 22 is there so just select java 22 now click on ok so we have set here as a user variable now we can set on the system variable level also so just click new and just do same thing java underscore home click on browse directory go to same place now you can see the path option here so just double click and here you can click on new and just type percentage java underscore home then slash bin that means it will take the java home path and inside that we have the bin folder now click on ok again you can type one more time so it is working fine in case if it is not showing then just try to restart your system Thank you.